save her. My daughter. How's it going guys? This is Lucian Sword. Welcome back to Hyrule. We're playing some more Breath of the Wild today and it is a beautiful day to be back playing some Zelda. We already completed all of the Divine Beasts. Uh, the final one in the last episode obviously. And uh, here we are at the stables. Here you go doggy. There's a couple dogs here. I want to I wanna feed this dog and then there's another doggy over there. This is the first stables that I've been to where there's two dogs. Oh sorry about that. It turned frozen. Do you still want to eat it or nah? Uh, I guess he does. <laughs> While he's eating that, actually, no, nah, I'm good. Eat the, you don't want the frozen meat? Are you kidding me? All right, he, he does not want frozen meat. He'll, maybe if I just drop some cooked meat, he'll, oh, I can't. Well, that's awkward. Uh, what if I drop apples? I think the dog was eating apples before too, right? <laughs> Dogs pretty much eat everything, right? Here, do you want some apples? I think he's going for it. Yep. See what I mean? Dogs eat pretty much everything. Alright, hopefully he will lead us to some treasure. Meanwhile, uh, we are going to be exploring in this episode. I know a lot of you are anxiously anticipating the Master Sword Trials, and I am as well. We are definitely going to do that. But, I'm looking at my quest log and I we just we have so many memories to, to try to get. We have eight left. So I wanna try to capture some memories today. And also, while we are looking for memories, we're also gonna be looking for shrines because there's a lot of shrines left that I have to do. So, today is going to be pretty much memories and shrines, not the sword trials, but we are going to get to the sword trials soon. Don't worry about that. And, uh, oh, Beta, why don't you go inside? I'm not gonna buy anything from you, bro. Just go inside. This dog is really slow at eating these apples, man. That's all I'm saying. I, I mean, I tried to get... He wouldn't even eat the frozen meat. I, I understand that, but... I'm starting to think those apples aren't gonna be enough. What if I drop, like, one steak? Here. It's gonna freeze if you're not quick, doggy. Oh my gosh. It literally freezes like instantly. <sighs> Alright, you gotta eat this one really fast. What if I drop a fish? Will he eat the fish? You want a fish? No? Uh, Alright, he only wants some meat. Alright, here, you gotta eat this one fast. Urbosa's fury is ready. He couldn't even eat it fast enough. It turned frozen that fast. Uh, all right. What if we what if we make a fire like really close and then then he won't then it won't freeze. Like we're trying to do everything to make this dog happy. Oh man, I don't even have I don't even have uh, a flame weapon anymore, guys. That's that's kind of sad. Uh, let's let's use some flint. It's like the only thing I ever use it for, I guess, is making a fire. <laughs> Sorry, doggy. All right, now, now if you come eat this meat, I'm trying to to put the meat close enough so that it doesn't freeze. Where is the meat? Oh, here we go. But but far away enough, you know, so that it doesn't catch on fire. Here. That that might not freeze. I'm sorry. The dog is literally so mad at me now. It's so mad. What if I put it like right here? Are you kidding me? I don't want to make all my meat frozen, dude. Alright, here. You gotta eat this one fast. Eat it fast. Alright, you know what? This is stupid. This is so stu- Alright, you know what? Forget you, dog. Forget you. I don't need your stupid chest anyways. Should have just kept giving him apples. All right, so on to the memories. Here is what we have so far. I've only captured four of them. Let's see. Let's just do them in order, I guess. So we're going to look at for this one. 
All right, I I pretty much know where this one is. I think it's it's like you can see the dueling peaks. It's pretty much around here, somewhere around Lake Cuomo. I think it's like on the hill over there. So uh, let's just put a yellow marker. And actually, I'm really far, so let's just head on over to Central Tower. And we can just fly on down to that memory. Maybe I'll see a shrine as well along the way. That is so stupid that the dog can't eat the meat before it freezes. I mean, he should just eat it frozen. Like, come on. Even when I put it next to the fire, it freezes. Like, come on. Anyways. Don't feel, don't feel bad for that dog. We gave him like five apples anyway. Alright, yellow marker is this way, so we're just gonna do this. Oops, okay, that was a bad one. No worries, maybe we can get a boost one right here. Not the best speed boost, but a little bit, nonetheless. Alright, maybe we can launch right here. Link, what are you doing? Thank you. Let's try this one. Ah. Oh. Sometimes I love this game. Other times the camera is terrible. All right. Think. Cup. Cup. Hey. Think. Cup. Hey. No. Stay on the. Okay. There we go. This way. Right. Okay. We're gonna do it the old-fashioned way. We're gonna walk my horse. Let's go, Cookie. I know you want to stretch your legs anyways. You were getting cold over in that other region anyways, weren't you? I didn't want you to freeze. Alright, so keeping an eye out for shrines. I don't see any on the top of my head, but actually I do. Hold it, hold it, hold it. I already marked that one too with the blue. Alright, so we need to go to that shrine. We'll get that shrine after this memory. Which, I think the memory is right over here by this lake somewhere. Huh. Kind of a cloudy huh. day in Hyrule. Ooh, what is that hanging from the tree? I thought it was a head. Just a long face. We got him. Like, man, this game is brutal. They got heads hanging from from chains. Alright. Uh, I think the Dueling Peaks memory is somewhere around here. I don't remember exactly where. Oh, yeah, over by that rock over there, maybe. Yeah. It's over there. I guess I don't need this armor on anymore, eh? Uh, which armor do we want to use? I got a lot of choices. Let's use Fierce Deity legs and armor. I still need the helmet. And for the helmet, Barbarian Helm, level 3 attack, baby. Actually, kind of looks weird, but we'll go with it. Alright, I think... The memory is right. Yeah, baby. We found it. Oops, sorry about that. Here we'll make our way to Goron City. Then we'll need some adjustments on that divine beast so Daru can manage it as easily as possible. He's figured out how to get it to move. However, it's apparent that we still have much more to learn. But to think, that divine beast was actually built by people. That 
means we should be able to understand how it works and how to use it to our advantage. No horse? These divine beasts. So much we don't know. But if we want to turn back Calamity Ganon, they're our best hope. Tell me the truth. How proficient are you right now, wielding that sword on your back? I'm pretty good. Legend says that an ancient voice resonates inside it. Can you hear it yet, hero? I hear voices in my head all the time, princess. That's why I never talk. <laughs> I'm a barbarian now, princess. I've joined the death cult. Uh, I no longer serve you, so yeah. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> All right, cool. So we got that memory down. Uh, let's see. Where's the next one? Um. Ah, yes. This one is looking the Hyrule Castle, and there's a big ugly tree next to it. So that means it should be somewhere over here. But I will, I will mark on the map where I think it is. But first, let's go get that blue shrine, remember? We are doing memories and shrines in this episode, not just memories. Let's go get that blue shrine I marked like four episodes ago when I was looking for EX chests. Oh, look at wild horses. So cool. Also, I think I'm going to uh, summon some more amiibos at the end of this episode, so for those that are interested. Ooh, how do I, I gotta go way around, don't I? Oh my gosh. What do we have here? Let's help this poor fool. You good? Come on, give me something good. Actually, let me see what I got. These elixirs are like just a waste of space, so I'm just gonna drink that. Come on. I know you're getting beat up pretty badly there, but... How come nothing ever goes my way? I'm sorry about that, Regan. Regan. Wow, you're not even gonna give me anything for saving your life? Last time I saved your life, Regan. Don't forget. Next time you're on your own. Yeah. Alright, let's see. I need to get way up there yeah. across, so we're going around. We're going pretty fast, though. So. Oh, oh. Cookie's pretty fast here. Oh, yeah, baby. Look how cool that looks. Where's the uh, pebble? We never found this. I remember looking for this rock. Like, literally on episode 10 or something, and I never found it to this day. I remember all these camps were so scary. And now it's like I could just go pwn all of them. I wonder where the rock is. We will never know where the stone is for that. Wait, I see it! It's behind the bush right there this whole time! How did I not find this before? Oh man, this is easier than I thought. The rock is never that far. Always remember that. It's never that far. It's usually pretty close. Man, we got 56 Korok seeds. Not bad. We haven't had a Blood Moon in a while, have we? I don't think the Lionel is respawn that's in there. I think the last time that I was in there, it was a silver lino, right? We, we just dominated it so easily. Yeah. Are we going up the... Uh, yeah, I guess we are. Yeah. We'll just go up the Coliseum and then fly across. Yeah. yeah, there was guys on the bridge, right? And they didn't respawn. Oh, actually. Yeah. Actually, they did. Do I hear something? I thought so. Wow. 
Why do I have this terrible bow? 12 damage? Just get... No, no, no. Just... No, no, no. We're... You know what? I don't even want those. Okay, there's platforms, but nobody on them. And there's no chests on the platform either, so yeah. No Blood Moon yet. The Coliseum, baby. There's a Lionel in there. Oh, Golden Lionel. I, oh, he's got a flame weapon. That's awesome. I do need more uh, weapons, so you know what? We might go fight this guy. Let's see. How much, how much defense is... See, I don't have any ancient weapons to be proficient with. That does 48 armor. This says 54. So I'm going to use this. Yep, it's time, boys. We're going to fight another Lionel. Then we'll go get the shrine. I do need some new weapons and, and shields and whatnot, so... Um... Alright, I'm a little nervous because I haven't fought a Lionel in a while, but I got some really good weapons here. So, we should be fine. Yeah, I got a lot of really good weapons. Not a lot of shields, though, so I'm hoping I don't shield break too much. Hey, big boy. Let's eat a... Uh, do I have, like, a defense elixir? Alright, that's good enough, I guess. Oh, I hit you in the face. Come on, man. Get that out of here. Oh. Can I freeze the Lionel? I don't think I can, but that would be pretty awesome. I like your flame sword, bro. It's really nice. Can I have it? Alright, Daru. Oh man, I thought I got by him. Charge me again. Do it again. That one was fun. Right, that one I got. Charge me, charge me. No? Oh man, all my weapons are breaking. Let's use a Master Sword. At least it doesn't break, you know what I mean? Oh, I sidestep. Are you kidding me? Alright, let's use the big one. 78. You know what? I should switch to my armor that does level 3 attack every time I'm on his back. Just to do maximum damage. You know what I'm saying? That would probably be smart. All right, all right. I guess we're eating some of this ice food. <laughs> Come on, do it again. I dare you. Oh man, we're running out of weapons. All right, that's all right. Well, I mean, we're not running out of weapons, but we're we're running out of weapons that I want to use. Ooh, demon carver. That was a lot of damage, man. He's only halfway. Don't be doing that on me. Alright, watch this, watch this. 
We're gonna get sneaky on this. Full attack. And then equip this. Full attack might be the way to go, to be honest. If I die, I'm gonna be really upset though, because we're already halfway, so just to be sure. Let's uh let's do that. Okay, I need a shield, that helps. What's the matter, buddy? You're struggling, dude, you're struggling. I want your I want your sword. Don't be doing that. We're doing maximum damage, boys. Woo, okay, that one hurt. Boomerang is down. Nope. Man, I'm breaking all my weapons. Got him. Another golden Lionel bites the dust. Maybe I got an attack boost on that fire sword? No, the sword shrunk. <laughs> we need Lionel parts anyways to upgrade some, uh, some weapons. Oh, shock arrows. Give me that shield. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, it's just a regular flame blade, but that's okay, because I needed one, right? And uh, what did we get for the bow? Uh, another 32 times 3. I was hoping we'd get a times 5 or a 42 times 3, but another lino bow is good. And then we got another 62 savage lino shield. So pretty good, pretty good haul. And uh, now that we're not distracted, let's go on t onward to that shrine. <laughs> Pretty cool that I never died on the Golden Lionel either. Oh, hi. You have a really nice spear. Well, if you're gonna play like that. I'll take the spear. Thank you. There's a lot of good weapons here. Oh, I don't have Revali. Ugh, I gotta climb this? Are you kidding me? Alright. <laughs> I'm so lazy now that I have Revali scale. <sighs> Let's climb up. Alright, I don't want to hear that sparkly sound all the time. What do you got? A frost weapon? A frost weapon? Man, these... The, and, and he's got a really good looking... Uh, he's got a really good looking uh, shield as well. Here, let's go unfreezable while we're fighting him. Fifty-five royal shield, another frost blade. All right, there we go. I was down on. Ah, uh, oh, look at that, another frost spear. On the uh, weapons and shield and stuff because I had to put them in my in my house. You know what I mean? Oops! I tried to cancel it. I hit somebody. Oh, he's got a flame sword too. You... All right, who did I hit? Was he up top? Oh yeah, he's above me. Man, well now you guys know where to go if you want elemental weapons. Holy cow. <laughs> so 
many elemental weapons. Are you kidding me? All right, uh, man, I'm gonna have to drop something. I don't need two frost blades, I guess, or two thunder spears. Actually, I mean, I don't even really need the great thunder sword, but I have a lot of spears, so I'm gonna drop. Um, I got two frost spears, two frost swords, two fr uh, thunder spears. Dang. I'll drop one of the Thunder Spears in, in turn for that. He's got another... Dang, he's got a shield, actually, and I do need shields. I need one more shield, and he's got a good one. That guy's got a Frost Sword. Is that a, That's a great Frost Sword. Man, this is so cool. I never knew that you come to the Coliseum. It's literally just packed. Are you kidding me? I was sneaking and everything. I'll take the Thunder Blade and the Royal Shield, and that was actually just a Thunder Blade, not a Great Blade, so that's even better. Oh yeah, that's awesome. Those are actually really rare. And uh, now we're good on shields, see what I mean? Alright, let's get out of here now. I gotta go to the other side. Uh, Alright, let's try Bomb Blast. This, this might not work, but hopefully I'll be able to Bomb Blast out of here. Not quite, but maybe I can get across. Ugh. Come on, Rivali, you're so slow. Get me out of this place. <laughs> I want to at least get the... Oh, gosh, come on, Link. You can do it. I want to get one shrine at least. Oh, no, I can't go that way. Here we go. Alright. Dang. Yeah, the Colosseum is packed with good weapons, guys. Good to know. Actually, I don't need that stamp right there. Now let's go get this shrine that I've been of trying to get to for like the last six episodes. There it is. Ugh. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, it's a stable shrine too. Uh-oh. You know what? We're gonna let that go. It's alright. It's alright. It's alright. Link, can you turn around, please? Turn. Keep turning. Keep, keep, keep turning. The Outskirt Stables. We bomb blasted our way all the way here. <laughs> I love the stables music. It's so good. Alright. There it is. My goodness. We made it. Oh, look at this one's like covered in moss. That is so cool. The Rota. Ooh, shrine. That is like the coolest looking shrine I have seen. Is it not? Please don't be a blessing. <laughs> All the shrines are blessings, it feels like. Just sipping on water today. No tea. That's not a blessing. Passing of the gates. Oh, hello. Man, I need some new bows. 
Like I said, we're probably gonna use amiibos. Alright, so if I throw the orb into this thing, will it just like launch it over there? Dang it! I don't like how I have to keep on wasting arrows to do this. Can I just... I guess not. What if I launch myself? This again. My bow broke again. I gotta like run off of it with momentum. There we go. Feathered Edge. Rito Craftsman forged this lightweight double-edged sword. That's cool. It's a Rito sword. We haven't been to the Rito place in a long time. All right, what are we dropping? Uh, I guess we're dropping this, like our worst weapon. So even though it's a good weapon, I'm, I might put the Rito sword in my house. I kind of want to put items from like all the different tribes or whatever in my house. Just to show how well-traveled and cultured I am, you know what I'm saying? Cool, cool. I don't even remember. Like, it's been so long since we did a spirit, uh, uh, shrine. I forgot how many spirit orbs we have. Probably not many. Yeah, we got two. All right. So we did, uh, I, <laughs> I was a little bit over ambitious in this episode. I thought we would do multiple memories, multiple shrines. Here we did one memory and one shrine, but we did kill a golden Lionel as well. We got tons of elemental weapons. We restocked all of our shields and swords. I just need some more bows now. So I'm going to go ahead and use all my amiibos and uh, hopefully we can get some rare items. And uh, if you guys are leaving, thank you for watching. Please drop a like. And uh, if you want to stick around for a few more minutes, watch me open amiibos. Here we go. Sword, a peculiarly great sword, allegedly used by a hero from a world in which the moon threatened to fall. It flashes wildly in battle, as if possessed by a fierce deity. Holy cow! 
cow. No, we are taking that. Uh, I don't need two of these, I guess. said to have been the favorite of a hero who traveled to open seas. It was apparently a family heirloom passed down through many generations. 65 defense on a shield. Wind Waker shield. Awesome. And we're doing really good today on the Amiibos. Time to do like one or two more chests, unfortunately, guys. Uh, let's see, I want the flame sword. Ooh, this is tough. You know what? I'm gonna have to drop the uh, the cross weapon. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. This is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next one. Take it easy, guys.